on bike to her YouTube channel. It's your girl Hopper Bye. Hey guys, so I just got the shower because I wanted to wash my hair and let it out and let it air dry so that I could um, straighten it a little bit later. So it is Monday. Please hold, I have to go. It's Monday. Um, as you can see, she is tan. <laughs> it's so funny because the whole time I was on vacation, I wasn't tanning. Literally, not like that. Like I wasn't getting a tan even though I was laying out. And then Wednesday, so day three, I started to see a little bit of color. And then Thursday, it was like no sun out. And I was like, okay, I'm just gonna leave here with not a great tan. I got home and my tan settled in. She's dark, <laughs> she's dark. I don't think I've ever seen my tan this dark. I've been like a few shades lighter than this, like maybe two, three shades last year. But yeah, I look, I look good though. I, I like a tan. Um, I'm waiting for like everything to peel on my face a little bit so that I can <laughs> wear makeup because I have nothing that matches this skin color. And my lips are badly sunburnt and they're really dark. They're like black uh, around the edges. So I'm waiting for that to peel. Thank God we gotta wear masks um, because I did end up having like a reaction to the sun. I forget what my mom said it was. Um, but like I woke up one day and my entire bottom lip was swollen. Like it was like literally hanging off. And the only reason I could tell was because obviously you're used to where you're, you, how you feel things. And I was like, my lip usually doesn't have that much space. Um, but my whole bottom lip was swollen for two days. Um, and it was one of the days that I was shooting content as well. It's actually, it's, if you see the photo on Instagram where I have on the all black and I was going like this, it's because my lip was swollen. <laughs> but yeah, whatever. So we're back home now. We've been back home um, for a few days. I have one more load of laundry to do. You guys know it just takes me forever to do laundry. And that's because I'm always good at the first two loads. But then when it comes to taking stuff out the dryer and folding it, I'm just like, I need a few business days, you know? Um, you guys also know that my Sony ZV-1 broke. So right now I'm on my Canon G7X. Um, it's not my favorite camera. I just feel like I can see the difference in quality. So right now I'm actually about to go and print the forms to send it to Sony to repair. Um, but as far as like what I did today, just a little catch up, um, obviously I have done nothing. I have been so exhausted since we got home. I'm definitely at that point in my pregnancy where my energy is depleting. Um, I literally could sleep all day and then still go to sleep early, like at 10 o'clock at night. I don't know what's going on with me. I don't know if it's because I just did so much during vacation, but I'm definitely exhausted. As we can see, the nails already came off. The eyelashes came off. Um, remember I was supposed to have a baby shower? I just ended up ordering the last few things. <laughs> Typical me. Um, it was only like four things I needed and they were like the big things. They weren't even, I didn't even need them. I could have lived without them, but I just went ahead and ordered them anyways. Um, so it's no sense for me to have a baby shower anymore. Um, I'm actually just gonna go on vacation one last time before baby. Um, so yeah. But you guys have been asking me to set up a PO box because I know a lot of you guys have been asking to send me over like your company stuff or whatever. I'm going to get around to that. Um, I just, I never go to the post office, honestly, but I'll do that for you guys. Just give me like a week or so. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go downstairs and find me something to eat because I'm hungry and go print these forms out so I can send my camera back tomorrow. And then, um, all right, so I'm so used to my other camera where it like beeps to let me know I'm recording. So Harper will not let the braids go. This is what they look like. Turn this way. They can't see. They're frizzy. She has some hair sleeping on them and stuff. Um, so now I'm about to redo them all. Because we got places to be tomorrow, things to do. Homegirl cannot be going outside like that <laughs> with me, okay?
I look so dark. <laughs> I need to have eyelashes. But it is Tuesday. <laughs> I just curled my hair. Um, so I'm just like breaking up all the curls. I don't know. I don't know why I did my hair like this. Honestly, who knows? My scalp is like really sunburned and peeling, as you can imagine. It's just, it's my lips for me. They look like I've been smoking all my life. And I don't like that. Uh, I've been putting the little sporn on them, but it hasn't been working. I burnt the shit out of my finger two seconds ago. Like it really hurts. I'm about to put some aloe vera on it. I don't know why I keep sitting on the floor like I'm not pregnant because this is actually like the fifth time I sat down on a different area of the floor. It's like I don't have chairs or something. Um, I'm too big for this. I'm like getting stuck. Again, I don't know why I did my hair like this. I was expecting it to be more wand, not wandy, like a tighter curl. But that's because I used this wand today. I used this Kristen S one. Um, so this is probably like a one and a half inch. It's gonna fall more, which I'll probably like it then. But right now, it just looks crazy. It's also just because I look crazy. So yeah, and my hair looks so short, but my scalp is so dry and sunburned. Like I just was sitting here flaking the skin off and every time I look, it's like a huge chunk. So I'll probably just wear my hair back with a, a clip. Not this clip though, this one is like janky looking. I have some prettier ones. Cause yes, I still wear hair clips. I don't care. I Listen, I think I'm gonna just throw on my Louis Vuitton hoops today or maybe just the smaller gold hoop that I have cause you guys know I have a couple pairs. Um, I don't know what I'm wearing yet. I didn't even tell you guys where I'm going though. So I have a 4D ultrasound appointment today for no reason other than, I don't know, bored. You know, you get to a point in your pregnancy, you're just like, what can I do? So yeah, I just made an appointment. So we're gonna go do that today. Um, and so that way Harper can see the baby like in action. I can do yesterday. No, we're not doing yesterday. yesterday. Oh. No, we're not. Let me see your outfit. No. Oh, girl. <laughs> yeah. That's why I told you, because like, people are... Ooh. Man. I'm confused. Do you want to go to the toy section? Like, what's happening? Toy section. I just said that. Is this baby? This other kid and this little boy. My other bump is at home. Huh? Look at the bump. <laughs> hey, 
Hey Alexa, turn on the lamp. I'm gonna get it. Hey Alexa, turn on the lamp. Hey Alexa, turn on the lamp for Harper. Why she don't be working? She janky as hell. Hey Alexa, turn on the lamp. Harper, did you unplug it? No. Never. Alexa. Turn on the lamp. Turn on the lamp. Oh my god. Why are you lying? Why is you lying? Um, hey guys. So, <clears throat> welcome back to Harper YouTube channel. It's your girl, Harper Guy. I did not take a shower. Why are you out of town like that? <laughs> so, get out of here. It's 10 20. I just woke up at 9 20, literally. I'd be so tired now. Like, every day I'm exhausted. Um, so. The ultrasound didn't go as planned because the baby has their foot has their baby is basically folded and has the foot in the face and is holding on to it. So I gotta go back tomorrow and hopefully get some face shots. From what we did see, the baby looks nothing like me. Of course. Whatever. I'm about to play with this um diaper pad i got the hatch grow but i wanted to like play with it before i threw the box out because i didn't want to throw the box out and then i decided i don't like it or something it's not as soft as the kikaru um i just don't like the shape of the kikaru you guys know i like like really clean lines so let me just show you guys so you guys know what i'm talking about like what the hell asia so <clears throat> as you guys can see this one is just like beveled I guess um but it's equal whereas I'll insert, insert a picture of the kikaru right here and as you can see like the kikaru is basically like a almost like a number eight kind of um and I know that one's soft because I did feel that one before um but I just don't like the shape so that's why I didn't get that one <laughs> And then they're made of like the same material where it's easy to wipe down. This isn't the softest thing ever. So, I don't know. I don't know. I did think this was going to be softer than it is. But this one has like a scale in it. So, you could connect it to your phone because 2021 babies, right? Everything's electronic. So, um, you could connect it to your phone and weigh the baby, which I think is not necessary. Like, I'm not one of those parents that's like... Oh my god, is my baby eating enough? So, yeah, I don't know, but we'll see. Um, yeah, I'm about to just play with it and see how I feel about it. And that way, if I don't like it, I can return it. Because I have to go to Bye Bye Baby tomorrow anyways. Uh, but yeah, so I'll come on here tomorrow. Yeah, I'll catch up with you guys. I need to into my nails so bad, but I ain't got no nail. I'm so sleepy though, guys. I literally am at the point in my pregnancy where I can nap all day and still go to sleep early. So I'm gonna be tired again in like an hour. So I'm just gonna do this really quickly. And then I'll come back tomorrow no, if I buy anything. I'll keep you guys updated. So yeah, my hair looks crazy. You guys know, I just love when my hair is like flat and sleek. Like this big stuff just isn't for me. Hello, hey friends. Today's Wednesday. Um, so today's Wednesday, so I'm just getting dressed because you guys know I have to go back to the ultrasound, please. Because the baby was not cooperating per usual. I expected that because Harper did the exact same thing. So I'm just getting dressed right now. I realized I didn't show you guys my outfit yesterday. I forgot. I was in a rush, but I'm gonna show you because I'm basically wearing the same thing in a different color. Ignore all the laundry. So these are those maternity biker shorts from Pretty Little Thing. So I wore the black pair yesterday. I'm just wearing a tan pair today because it's like 80 degrees outside. They're comfortable. They're easy. It don't feel like getting dressed. And all my white bras are dirty. Look at the sunburn peeling. That is not cute, girl. I look like I got, I don't know. But that's not cute. Um, Where's this white craft top from? I actually think this is a pretty little thing too. It's really old. It actually it is a pretty little thing. Um, my boobs feel a little smushed, but it'll do for now. I'm not tripping. 
yesterday i wore that gray bralette from forever 21 from my forever 21 haul you guys remember i really really love that thing it's so comfortable has good coverage um but like all my other bras that match this because this is such a weird tan it doesn't look good or they're like too revealing so i just put this white crop top on i don't know what shoes i'm wearing honestly um i don't know what's going on with my hair but we're gonna let her rock out my lips are so black i literally look like i've been smoking the plant all my life like i've been on the phone all day with like the embassy and the u.s consulate and i'm like just so irritated because america's ghetto but anyways so yeah i don't know what shoes i'm gonna wear ignore the mess it's just things everywhere <laughs> i'm just too big to be cleaning um i was gonna wear my dad's sandals to see if i like them maybe i'll give them a try but honestly i might just slip on my louis vuitton sandals again because they're comfortable um and i don't really feel like switching my bag but i wore my black bum bag yesterday does it really matter in retrospect that my bag doesn't match no let's see if it looks fine i'm starving i need to go get something to eat why am i showing you guys everything i don't know yeah i'm just gonna throw on my louis vuitton slides again because i'm not going anywhere um and just throw this bag on again today because i don't feel like taking that stuff out even though it's literally nothing in it literally but a card holder and some hand sanitizer <laughs> i just don't feel like picking a bag so yeah, it's my little OOTD for today. I'll probably put on some nude glasses or some brown ones. It's just dead skin peeling every which way. But I'm actually going to go ride to give me some food really quick because I'm starving. Um, and then by the time I eat, it'll be time to get on the road anyways to the place. Because you guys know it's in Jersey, like I told you. It's in like Deptford or something. Um, so, yeah. I really love these baggage shorts. If they came out of them in every color, I'll probably still wear these after pregnancy too because they're just that comfortable. Um, and I think they're back in stock now on the site. And I actually was on the site yesterday just scrolling. And they have like the leggings version now, but it's too hot for leggings. But if you like leggings, they do have them. I'll link them down below for you guys. But yes, yeah, so I'm just going to wear this today. It's 80 degrees, like I said. I'm not putting on nipple pasties or anything because who the hell has time? listen the baby is going to be in the right position today so we can see the face because yesterday like just wasting my time you know ttyl get to this tan though y'all this tan fire who is she i definitely look like i was running around cambodia and stuff but you know i'm not mad i'm not mad at it okay we're gonna sleep good tonight right here of course you Bread. My mom and Brady though because it was like all the beads were like falling off my hair. You maybe know that on our next YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. Bye. Hey guys, um it's still Wednesday. I just woke up again like two hours ago. It's 8 10 52 right now. When we got home, I was exhausted. I started feeling like a lot of pressure in the lower region today uh and it's not comfortable so we got home at like four five o'clock and i was knocked out uh to the point that i didn't want to wake up but i was like sw not sweating but i just didn't feel clean does that make sense if you hear a sound in the background that is a fan i bought a fan today like let me show you i bought ignore the laundry you guys know it takes me a while to do laundry well not do laundry fold laundry but i bought a fan because um uh, y'all i be overheating like so i don't sleep good at night because i'm always hot but i i'm also just pregnant and i'm far along so i just get really really hot throughout the night so yeah i'm gonna go find her a bike do this email wash the hands made tell and i will come back on here tomorrow and catch up with you guys um i'm trying to debate if i want to get my lashes done or not because i look crazy but yeah so i will talk to you guys tomorrow say good night heart you're having a bad day why was your day bad go ahead tell them you look like you got a job like life is so stressful what why was your day bit? I never tell. Okay.
But yeah, we'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Hopefully Harper has a good day tomorrow. That's cute. She looks like a little giraffe. <laughs> oh my God, where's my little light? <laughs> good morning, guys. It's actually not morning. Full disclaimer, it's two o'clock. I may or may not just be getting up. Me and Harper slept till one o'clock today. Um, I don't know why we've been so tired. This is a terrible angle. This is terrible lighting. Let me at least turn on one lamp in here. So I just got back upstairs. I went to like refill my water bottle, put some fresh lemon in it. I made me a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I was making heart one and then I was like, ooh, I want one too. <laughs> so I made me a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, which is my breakfast, lunch. Kind of bummed. I didn't have no plain like chips, but can't win them all. So yeah, it's Thursday and I just was so tired. You guys know I got that fan. I slept amazing last night. So me and Harp just have been being lazy all day. She went to like her two glasses and then we just were like, you know what? We don't got time for this let's go back to sleep so yeah we both were being lazy um i'm gonna do my hair in a little bit i'm gonna straighten it probably but for right now why would i promote a scrub line i'm not a nurse what um my skin is so soft like what's a poor to a bitch like me um but yeah all right i'm gonna go shop so exciting and then i would go to the mall but apparently somebody like they started fighting and came pressure the other day and that's like a lot that's too much for me so we're just gonna online shop and yeah i will see you guys a little bit later I look crazy because i got on this big old t-shirt but i don't care so why does that keep beat me um i just finished straightening my hair I'm like so sick of straightening my hair. My hair is like so full that it's just a hassle. I wish I could like go to a hair salon and get a blow dry. I'm gonna move the camera in front of the window. Wow, I'm orange. Um, so I'm just sitting downstairs because I ordered some food because I'm starving. I wanted some pasta, so I just typed in pasta and Uber Eats. So we shall see if it's good. Um, Cause it's almost the weekend, so I didn't want to like go out and get anything. So I ordered lasagna, spaghetti, cheesesteak egg rolls, and the chicken bacon ranch pizza. Don't ask. Don't ask. I'm pregnant. I'm hungry. It's freezing in my house. Um, it's like I don't understand why the air is so cold, but whatever. So yeah, I was shopping online for a while. And then I, just, I get tired of it so quickly. Um, so I'm about to just resume that down here. I was like starting to have like back pains. So I just came to sit downstairs for a little bit. Where'd you go? I missed you so. Look at you, you always wanna be all in the mix. So. I ordered cheesesteak egg rolls. Remember I told you guys that? My Uber driver dropped them. He was talking to me through the window and he dropped them because it was two cars behind him on my street and he was rushing and he dropped them. It was one in there and I like tried it just to see if it was good. But then I got to call Uber. Oh, this looks so good. Oh my God. I had to call Uber now because I want my $21 back for my cheesesteak egg rolls that I didn't get. But look, mm. If you've never had a chicken bacon ranch pizza, oh my God, you're missing out. Not wait to get my Sony ZV-1 back. I just don't like this camera. They have the Sony ZV-1 in white now and I like want it, but yeah. So I got some lasagna because I couldn't decide if it was high too. It was like, mm. Mm, it was expensive. It was like $25 per entree and I got like four. Why do you have a band-aid on your face? We're twins. Oh, okay. Yeah, this looks really good. And this looks good too. So we're going to just try everything. And This is what pregnant people do. They just eat, you know. And my dog is just like, girl, got my fancy forks. Bleach hair. <clears throat> hey, puppy boy, come here. Come here, puppy boy. Come here, puppy boy. Oh my goodness, what is going on with him? Why is he making like he got on an ocean? Come here. Come here. 
Come here. Come this way. Come this way. This way. Hello. Hold on. Let me close my pizza because little fat boy is going to try to eat it. Hello. Oh, just to him. He is the cutest little baby boy. And he's so soft when him gets a bath. Hello, puppy boy. Hello. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Being pregnant means that <clears throat> you'll be in a mood to eat something and then you get it and you just realize it's not what you wanted at all. So I thought I wanted pasta. Turns out I didn't want pasta. Um, it was really good though. The lasagna, the lasagna is good. It just, it's not what I wanted. So this is why I just eat french fries and shit all day because... When has a potato ever let me down? Right, puppy boy? All right, so it's been like 30 minutes. Um, I'm about to go back upstairs because the baby, I don't know if I ever told you guys, <clears throat> but ever since like my second trimester, the baby has been weighing, I mean weighing, not weighing, sorry. Uh, sorry. <laughs> Ever since like the second trimester, early in the second trimester, the baby has been measuring a week ahead of me. And you guys have noticed that like, I'm not, I'm gonna show you guys my belly. Let me, let me give you a belly update. So this is my current belly. Um, so I am carrying small with this pregnancy. I don't know if I ever told you guys, but with Harper, I started off at like 115 pounds and I gained like 40 to 45 pounds. Watch out puppy boy. Um, so I ended up gaining a lot of weight cause I was so small back then. And then now I started off at 150-ish, like 153. Um, I've only gained 12 pounds. That's how much I gained at my last appointment, which was, I don't know, not long ago. So at this point I probably only gained 13 pounds. Um, so i'm small oh the camera is dying oh my god let's go upstairs and finish this conversation all right we're back so like i was saying um this time around i like had the whole conversation with my doctor because i just was like you know should i be concerned um i know everyone carries differently but because i did gain so much weight with harper and duvet has like a weird stain on it but okay um i was like you know am i doing something wrong um is everything okay so basically my doctor was telling me that like it kind of just always depends on the person their bmi their body type um and where they start off at so she was like because i was so small with Harper is my starting size. I did end up gaining the full 30 to 40 pounds that most people do gain. Um, and then when I had Harper, I lost all the weight right after. Like I went back to being really, really tiny. I went right back to 115, I wanna say within like two months. Um, and then when Harper turned one, all my weight came back to me. So you've been following me for a while course you probably haven't but when i had harper i was literally a little stick and then when harper turned one is when i got like this weight to me that i am now where i literally guys i went from like a size 23 in jeans maybe 24 on a good day to like a full-blown 27 which is so crazy because a lot of you don't ever think i'm like that size and like i always watch other people's videos they look bigger than me but they actually wear sizes under me um yeah like i'm like a size 27 in jeans i could probably fit a 28 when i'm not pregnant i buy everything in a medium you guys know like uh i'm not as small as i look um but basically so yeah with this pregnancy i've only gained 12 pounds um at my last appointment she said everything was fine everything was healthy and like i said the baby is measuring this fan like come on beyonce like uh um uh the baby has been measuring a week ahead of me and like length and size and weight and all of that as of right now baby is big okay so i'm telling you that because what happens is i like to lay down a lot and it's not because i'm lazy and i want to lay down but it's because when i'm sitting since there's not a lot of me but there's a lot of baby 
um, it hurts. So I just feel everything in my rib cage. I feel every little movement of the baby. The baby is head down. Um, the baby has always been kind of head down my whole entire pregnancy, every time I had an ultrasound. So I just feel like it, an intense pressure when I'm sitting in my vagina, my birth canal, whatever you want to call her. Um, so I feel like the baby's head down there. Um, as of lately, I've been feeling a lot of pressure down there, like getting ready for birth. Um, but when I'm sitting, what happens is, is it just hurts. I'm just uncomfortable as hell. Like even right now, just sitting here talking to you guys, um, everything is just at the top and in my rib cage. So when I lay down, it balances me out a little and it provides extra room. No, they're my snack. How you gonna try to come in here and take my Doritos? Um, but I like to lay down because it just stretches me out. Whereas when I'm sitting, I'm more confined and small and like shrunken. It kind of doesn't make sense. It probably sounds dumb, but yeah, like sitting just hurts. So that's why I either need to be walking or laying down. Like I just don't like sitting. Like even right now, it hurts. I'm uncomfortable and like the baby is like moving a little bit, um, but it just is it makes me really really uncomfortable the same thing started happening around this time with harper as well up until i gave birth but that's also why i was scheduled to get induced with harper because i get really really uncomfortable like i have a small frame you know like even though um i'm not like small small anymore i have a small frame i can't lie guys this fan is a game changer for me like I have not turned it off since I got it. I turned it down to one when I woke up and I slept with it on three, but it just feels so nice. So I might schedule to get induced again so that we have like a concrete date, but I was scheduled to get induced with Harper and I wanted to labor a day early than my inducement date uh, or induction date. I don't know, but I would much rather want to go into labor or like by myself um, because I just have heard horror stories about Pitocin, like some people being in labor for days. Um, and I don't feel like I would be one of those people because I do good with medication. But yeah, so I don't know. That's just an update on that for you guys because you guys are just Good morning, aka afternoon, because I'm so tired today again. So this is my house outfit of the day. I just have on some pink eye shorts, the black pair, and this bralette from Urban Outfitters featuring my hair clip because I always need it. But I need to go downstairs because I need some water. So give me two seconds. How do you know it's new? Because it's white. <laughs> All right, so I'm just downstairs. I just refilled my water jug and I'm making myself a breakfast sandwich so I can eat and drink some water really quickly before I make myself a coffee because I need it today. I don't ever drink coffee. I think the last time I had a coffee was the last video that I showed you that I had a coffee. Um, I'm not a coffee person, I'm more of a tea person. But because I'm feeling so sluggish, I just, I need it. Um, I also think it's because like I overdid it on vacation, like waking up at five in the morning, swimming, beach life, all that stuff. So yeah, I'm just making a little breakfast sandwich, Jimmy Dean. Like to have this baby. Well, guess what? Who would have to take care of it? Who? Me.
Mm -hmm. All right, so it's 8.38. <laughs> and I'm just finishing my work day. I'm like laying to the side because I'm hopefully, hopefully you guys can hear me with the fan. Now I feel like I need to go get a fan with the remote. Cause how am I supposed to turn it off when I've got a vlog? Like, don't nobody want to hear the white noise in the background? Anyways, so yeah, it's 8.39 now. And I just finished my work day. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I just felt like the, um, what was that character on Spongebob? I remember I just kept doing it the whole time. <laughs> um, anyways, so I had to shop for three sponsored videos that are all coming up. So don't get sick of me and my sponsor content. It's the sponsor content you guys like. And yeah, they just all happen to be at the same time. I didn't plan it. Um, but it's so funny because you know how like these are all sites that I shop at anyways. So like when I go on the sites and I'm spending my money, I could find things in like an hour, right? When it's time for me to do it for a video and it's sponsored, it takes me forever because you have to make sure you're finding stuff that's like has sizes in stock so they're like I, I don't want to recommend you guys something that like every size is out of stock except for my size and then it has to like be cohesive for a video so you want to get things to like you could style you know like I'm not gonna be like hey look I got a pair of panties you know what I'm saying even though I show you guys bralettes all the time but that's different because bralettes are close to me but like then I had to think of like a video like okay like it needs to just all make sense y'all I've been doing that since two o'clock since I started working and like I said I had to shop for three videos I don't want to look at any more clothes but now I'm about to just sit here oh I actually ordered dinner my food should be here in like three minutes um I'm not gonna go eat take a break and then finish doing my online shopping where I spent my money um for the collective haul i am now building like legit building my post baby wardrobe so a lot of comfy things a lot of very cute summer things a lot of breastfeeding friendly things um just to make my life a little bit easy but as soon as i have the baby i want to be cute comfortable and back to like getting dressed and stuff because it is my job i cannot wait to be able to buy clothes like that I don't have to take my belly into consideration even though I love my belly but like doing fashion content it makes it really really hard because obviously I like shopping look at the dog I like shopping in the regular section so yeah it's like I love my belly but at the same time I cannot wait to produce like my content will be unlimited at that point because I won't have to limit myself to what I could pick out you know what I'm saying so yeah and the companies have just been killing it for the summer clothes like literally i don't know maybe it was the lockdown and these brands and stuff but yes yeah, so i'm gonna go eat dinner and yeah, well, what are you doing you're so dramatic because i'm barely touching you <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my god. Show them your, your tooth. So this is the one just fell out. Mm -hmm. This is the one it just fell out. Mm -hmm. Show them the loose one. Okay. <laughs> Oh my god. The dog made my head fell down. Why are you side eyeing me for? What did I do? Why you want to stay? Fidget toy set. Wow, Harv, it says fidget toy set. This is what the kids like these days. Let's see what we got. No way. What are these, Harv? Um, they're one of these like bracelets. This is not a bracelet. They're like desatisfying things you just watch on. What? They're desatisfying things on TikTok. They're what? They're satisfying things on TikTok. I can't say They're that. satisfying. You need to wash your face. What does this do? Oh, you 
there's balls in them. You just play with the balls? Yeah. This is weird. Is this what you make me spend my hard earned money on these days? Oh. I don't know what's this. This is not a circuit. You don't even know what it is. Yeah, these are what I was talking about. So you wanted the one thing? I think you take this ball, yeah, you take it apart and then you gotta put it back together. Oh. <sighs> Guys, so. It's a little bit later in the day like literally a little bit it's only 7 40. i'm so tired i like well, i don't even know what to do with myself i was in the bed and i was about to fall asleep and i was like asia oh, sorry you can't take a nap because you take a nap you're just gonna be doing this all week so yeah i'm just exhausted guys unfortunately i think that like once i get to the point that i'll probably still vlog every day but i think i'm gonna start easing off of the vlogs and producing like a lot of the video sit down videos for you like that i could just push out once or twice a week um and then just take a break from vlogging um I don't know when i'm not saying right now but i'm just saying like in the next upcoming weeks especially once baby is here like to just not pressure myself like i'll still film but i won't pressure myself to post it um but i am going to try to do as many pre-recorded videos as possible so that even when i do take time off for baby um you guys are still getting content for me so yeah, like I plan to do the baby gear video, the pregnancy must-haves, Asia's Corner. Um, I don't know. I got a few videos in my head that I'm going to just try to sit down and film within the next like two to three weeks for you guys. And that way you guys have content when I take my maternity leave. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm going to literally log out and go to bed because i'm tired guys so i will see you guys next week hopefully you have a video for me on wednesday my goal is to film that tomorrow um so yeah i will see you guys then thank you guys so much for watching as always and i'm just tired i know it's expected i feel bad saying i'm tired but it's like my body just has no energy i just have no energy i just i kind of feel like my body's like preparing to like really go into labor really really soon and it's making me nervous because I didn't even pack a hospital bag yet. Or a baby bag. Nothing. Like, if I was to go into labor right now, shit would be crazy. <laughs>